Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying four mini candy bars. These were bought at the Fresh Market. They were only 99 cents a piece. The Fresh Market brand. They're Fresh Market brand. And I have probably, they probably always had them and I just never saw them. But they have like a, a coffee bar um, in the Fresh Market. And I was walking past the coffee bar and I was like, oh, what are these little tiny candy bars? These, uh, coconut black lava sea salt and toffee pretzel sea salt, both in milk chocolate. And both of mine are dark chocolate. Mine is the Himalayan pink sea salt. And this one's the 70% cacao. Cacao! I always think of birds saying that. Uh, yeah. Cacao! Cacao! Okay, so I'm gonna try to get this up. There you go. Or did I come Kevin, can, Kevin can show you how it, uh, how it looks, how this comes. So this is the coconut black lava sea salt. Just three little bars and flans in it. I mean, there's nothing these, fancy there. These are made in Greensboro, mm. North Carolina. Yeah. Ooh, it smells uh, like a strong coconut. Uh, they're, uh, it's uh, www.thefreshmarket.com. Right, mm. It doesn't have calories on it. Oh, okay. No calories in <laughs> Calorie free. It seems like I had looked it up. But I don't remember. I like the texture of that. Mm-hmm. It's got a um, That sea salt is perfect. Mm -hmm. It's it's a really good blend of coconut and salt. Um yeah, I love the chocolate flavor. The textures are it's not like a crisp chocolate, it's kinda got mm -hmm. this grainy like crumbly kind of texture to it. It, um, it's really good. that is a very, very nice quality chocolate. It tastes rich. Mm -hmm. And oh, yeah. so it, it's not hard. Like, um, I won't compare any other brands because some people hate it when I mention other brands. They're like, why are you down and blah, blah, blah. Um, but uh, it's not like other brands of chocolate that are hard. This is actually very, very smooth and creamy. And then they, they get the shards of the, the coconut in there. And then the, the big hunks of sea salt. Yeah, that that's is, good. that's a beautiful a chocolate. Uh, chocolate bar. I like that. Okay. This. I don't know if I would have called it lava cake or whatever they called it. But... And I'm still getting uh, salt out of my teeth. Yeah. I, I, love I don't lava. know if the black lava thing is what you give me this for. I can't read any of that. I don't know. Exactly <laughs> the opposite. Uh, this is the toffee pretzel sea salt, which I love toffee. Basically looks the same. And like it says for additional information, please call. Do they really want people disturbing them at work to say, hey, how many calories are in your candy bars? No, just put it on the bar. Yeah, just put it on here. I put it on your website. I like the salt in that one too. Mm -hmm. I like the saltiness in that chocolate. It's what gives it that texture because it breaks it up a little bit. It's terrific. It's very, very good. That one has, was as good as the other one. If you don't like coconut, get the toffee. One. You could get the toffee pretzel. I don't know. I get a little bit of the pretzel flavor. I, yeah, I, that's what I was going to say. I don't know that I would have necessarily said pretzel because with pretzel, you get the salt and they're already giving you salt. So I don't know. Maybe there is some of that texture in there, yeah. some of that crunchy the texture. The slight brownness of bread flavor yeah. kind, of, kind of is there. This one is, is terrific as well. Mm -hmm. I personally think I like the coconut better. I like the better. coconut. If I were to get one out, but I like coconut. So. Um, but like as with the coconut one, I'm still getting that salt out of my teeth mm -hmm. and I, I love Good. it. Okay, Himalayan, Himalayan pink sea salt. And dark chocolate. Yes, these two are gonna be dark chocolate. So it will be interesting to see uh, what their dark chocolate tastes like. How dark is, is it gonna be? Himalayan pink sea salt. Got a snap to it. A little bit. 
definitely it's a different a crisper texture. Too good to salt though. It's good. I feel like cherish. I love it, love it, love it. <laughs> um, I love the salt. Yeah, I mean, you're literally getting crunchy pieces of salt when you're eating it. It is so oh, pleasing to your good. to your teeth because it's like it's like a thick layer of of uh, something, and your your teeth just collapse it. It's a it, but it's it's firm enough to where you can feel your teeth going through all those layers. Yeah, it's got a crispness to it that you did get with the milk chocolate. Milk chocolate's more creamy, smooth. It's very the, creamy. The dark has a little snap to it. Yes, but it it. But uh, it's not hard. Yes, and it's not incredibly bitter. It's I mean yeah. there is of course a slight bitterness to it. To let you know it's dark. <laughs> yes, but it's not anything like we've had some incredibly dry. Uh, okay. that'll dry your home and this one might because this is 72 percent cacao if anything's going to dry your mouth out it seems like this would um but this this is dark without being that dark without the drying quality oh. <laughs> mm. still got a really good texture to it mm-hmm it's a fantastic texture. Mm -hmm. So it's a good chocolate, even when it doesn't have salt. I'm missing the salt though. Um, that honestly did it did not leave my mouth dry like a lot of yep. that high percentage uh, dark chocolate does. I actually really like that. I really like it for a dark chocolate, plain dark chocolate. Yes, it, but it, that's exactly what it is. It's a plain dark chocolate without so all three of the other ones had that salt with mm -hmm. it and um, so this is it, it's actually this one's kind of refreshing because it didn't have the salt. It almost has a fruity like flavor. It's almost like okay you're taking a break from all that unhealthy salty eating <laughs> and you're gonna have just the pure dark chocolate. It's, it's I actually good. like this as well. Mm -hmm. I think this is a very good brand. Mm -hmm. uh, the Fresh Market. I would get any of these and you might be wondering, are they worth 99 cents for a very small candy bar? I think they are mm -hmm. because you're getting what three of these three squares, pretty good size hunks, three, and they're thick. And you're not going to just eat this, you know, you're not gonna, you're gonna get at least six bites out of that, you're gonna mm -hmm. get two bites out of each square. And That's how it would be yeah, so I definitely think it's worth 99 cents. I think it's good. Think so so what would the coconut be, one's my favorite. The coconut, I think, I think I'm gonna say that too. The coconut black lava sea salt, but. But I think I would definitely put the Himalayan sea salt dark chocolate one in the it's dark chocolate it, too, yes. I like that salt, but I like salt too. Yeah, I like salt too. <laughs> I, I think it's delicious. But any of these, if you've ever passed by where they sell the coffee, this was like- um, A lot of people drink coffee and chocolate, and eat chocolate. Yeah, and that's probably why they have it there. Uh, but I have not seen these like over in the regular candy bars. I know, that's weird. So, and they might have them. They might have, they might have big ones because the Fresh Market's really good about selling larger candy bars as well. Yeah, I don't remember um, ever seeing these. My only complaint is I wish they put the, the nutritional information on the package somewhere, even if they put it on the inside once you opened it. I do think I looked it up, but um, I think it's been a little while ago, so I just don't remember how much yeah. it was. I mean, I, I think But I don't know that it's accurate, because yeah. I think it was somebody just putting it into my fitness pile. Well, that, guessing. Yeah, well, that could be anybody guessing anything. Yeah. Or that, they called, one of the two. But that, they know. could have called, yeah, I have no idea. That, that would be my only complaint, is I wish they would put the labels on there, but beyond that, I think they're, they're excellent. Excellent quality chocolate bars. So if you are ever in there, I would absolutely give them a try. I hope that they'll come out with something different, something seasonal. I think that would be really cool. I don't know. Now I know to look and to keep my eye on them. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.